Developing tonight in Birmingham, a renewed effort from police to solve the murder of former Mississippi State receiver Daranya Wilson. He was shot and killed in January 2020, and still no arrests have been made. As CBS 42 News reporter Marina Bach tells us, police are determined to get answers. Investigators sharing with us that they've continued to make progress in the case, but they believe someone out there does have information that could lead to an arrest and bring this case to a close and provide closure to the Wilson family. Deronye Wilson was a son, brother and friend whose life was taken too soon. We're here in the 2100 block of Northland Avenue Southwest. This is where Deronye Wilson was murdered while in his home on January 21st, 2020. It's just daily conversations about him and not just what happened to him, but just him because he got such a big legacy that he left. But many people knew Wilson for his outstanding skills on the football field as well as the basketball court. He got to high school to kind of focus on basketball. But uh, they got him to come out his senior year, and I think by the third game, they realized that he could be a Division One receiver because he took, like, I think his first pass that he ever caught was like an 80-yard touchdown. Cedric Lane was Wilson's former coach. He watched him grow into a standout athlete and then go on to play football at Mississippi State University. More of a father figure type relationship because I got him from when he was maybe 13, from down in middle school, watching him, bringing him up as a freshman and uh, having him play four years for me. And uh, so I just watched him grow uh, as a young man, as an athlete. And memories like these are all that's left for family and friends of Wilson's as the Birmingham Police Department continue to push for leads. His killers are still at large. Duranye's family deserve justice and they deserve closure. But the fact that you don't want it to happen to somebody else's uh, family member, that that's, that's the main reason we kind of need closure. Because they his family's still suffering. They 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 were such a close family and they, they really loved each other. And if you do have any information on the Wilson case, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers or the Birmingham Police Department Homicide Division with that information. Reporting in Birmingham, Marina Bach, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.